there this morning. Yes. How are you? That is, there was no winner. Well, okay. He's all right, Alan Imrawai. Nazgatir. 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 Yes. Um, our instructors, my colleague Puyuel, all the referees, committee, our deputy secretary, and now acting secretary, my daughters and my, my sons. As it was said, you are now the foundation of refereeing committee in South Sudan. This talent, this talent course was not done in our history. It has never been done in our history. And we want to, to thank FIFA leadership under the leadership of uh, Gianni Infantino, Madame Samora, Fatma, for taking care of South Sudan. And also our able president, Mr. Patrick, in CAF. All the leadership of football in the world, both FIFA and CAF, their eyes are always in South Sudan. They want to make sure, they want to make sure the young country, the young MA member association is also brought up to the level of others as soon as possible. And that is why we are very grateful for the opportunities they are always giving to us, sending instructors to give us courses so that we catch up with, the, with other federations who have gone ahead of us. And I'm sure with you, the new and young uh, referees, we will always have more number now. Now we have six or we have eight? How many in uh, international? Nine. We have nine international. If you do well in the future, we will be more than that. We may go to 12, we may go to uh, other numbers. But refereeing is not, it's not like playing football. There are a lot of challenges in refereeing. There are a lot of challenges. Your mom will be insulted. You, you will always... Uh, you are in the risk when you are officiating. And that is why our instructor Ali said there is a policy of protection of the freeze. Because if you are not protected, then we will not play football. And that is why we have, we are going to train also our stewards, and we, have, we are going to increase their number so that when you are officiating inside, they are there also to protect the match, they are there also to protect you. Because Everybody can make mistake. You can make mistake. There is no referee that has never made mistake. But the fans outside, they don't come to do that. You can do very good, but once you miss something, alas, things will turn very bad. And we need to give them more awareness so that people also understand that you are also a human being. You can make mistake, and you can correct that mistake. The base is, you know, you have been accused sometimes, some of you have been accused that, oh, you are siding with a certain club. These are accusations levied on referees, which is not true. If you are trained, do your work, be, 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 uh, be transparent, yes. Once you, I, I used to tell my, my, my footballers, that referee is, a, is like two things, like, two, like, a, like a priest, like a pastor in the church, and like imam also in the mosque. When a pastor is talking to the church on Sunday, can anybody raise his hand and say, Pastor, you are wrong? He's all good, is it? The same thing with the, with the imam in the mosque. If he's also preaching the word of Allah, nobody will raise up and say, what you are saying is wrong. It is the same with referees. And this is the respect we will have to you. When you are there, we expect all the fans, all the players to respect you, to respect the decision that you take. Whether it is a wrong decision or it is a, it is a good decision, people need to respect that decision. Because without you, there is no football. We cannot play football without the freeze. So you are part and parcel of the game. And the game is beautiful because of you. So I don't want to prolong my, um, my speech, 
but we will have another day when we will be coming to close, when we will be coming now for some of you to, te to testify the knowledge that you got within these five days. That is where we will, we will speak more. However, I would like to uh, convey the greeting of the President to all of you. I was talking to him outside and I told him about this opening. He's currently in, uh, in Tanzania for uh, General Assembly, both Sikapa and CAF, together with Secretary General. And he's conveying his greetings to all of you, to all the referees and all the my talents, uh, uh, future referees in South Sudan. So he's greeting all of you, and he wishes you all well. Stay, and then when you go also, when he's not yet here, you also go well. And we'll say that later. So may I now, uh, with these few remarks, declare this training, this workshop, officially open. Uh, the, the flowers and the, and the new fruits of the South Sudan My brother Anashi, on behalf of uh, FIFA President, uh, Mr. Vianney Mantino, it's a big pleasure for us today to be here in Juba. And not really first time and second time, but we feel home. Uh, we thank you so much, Mr. Vice President. We have been well received at the airport. Uh, we are having very good accommodation, and uh, I think we are not complaining so far. <laughs> uh, I'm really very happy to see young people who are the future of South Sudan, because like Genoa Fraser said, the German, uh, I've been going through South Sudan, and it's one of my countries in the region, because I'm the German of the Referees Committee of the Region and member of the CAF Referees Committee by now. And I was following one by one. Uh, if you know, if maybe you are new, but uh, we, have, we have been having Malong and maybe Gassi Madir and maybe the rest. Now we want to hear some other new names. Yes. And, then, and then you can make history. You can go to the World Cup. It's very easy and very simple for one country like so to them, like Somalia, uh, one of the referees or one of the, of the assistants to take the name and the flag to the World Cup. But it's a lot of hard work for the national team to do this. So you have the Janis, do the Janis. I saw this morning, I congratulate you first of all on behalf of uh, Haneshi and the rest of the instructors the Deputy General Secretary, I was really very pleased to see a flower speaking in front of you. Yes. I want to thank you very much for coming. Thank you very much for your participation. I think we'll be having five uh, good days. Remember, out of 365 days, we'll be only five days with you. But we'll try to leave you something that you can remember. I am very confident, not because they are in front of me. We have been pushing them. We have. Uh, Qualified instructors. Where is Akon? Okay. Akon is there, yes. Uh, we invite her in Sakafa. We give her the chance. She did very well because she has the quality. I know her. I know all of my colleagues. I send them sometimes to Futur Arab, to Futur English, all of them. We are trying to develop the region because uh, our policy of referee development is to help referees from the basics. Coming to the participants, I know some of you. Um, may, may have difficulty in English, but you can speak Arabic, which is a very good language. Try, like you said, I emphasize, try to learn English because... What language? Some of us are talking English, some not Arabic. But you have a chance because you are still young. You must know, if you know Arabic, you are English. If you know English, you are French. For Arabic, add French, you must know two language guys, because it's your future. At the same time, it's our future as a republic in South Sudan. I don't want to talk more, Mr. Ali and Hanaji. I am sure, by your experience, you are going to help those young people like each us before. All those days, we are 
going to support you for what you need. We are going to talk more. We are going to sit together because all of us here, we need to know more from you, not just young people alone. All of us here, we need to know more from you. So my dear referee from today, I want you to be under responsibility of those instructors 